Oh, do not worry, I did not forget about you. For those of you watching this video, go uh, click this comment so you can see the uh, hot take video. Um, but before I can elaborate more, let me direct your attention to direct your attention to this channel right here. You're gonna want to go to NC Hammer 23, cool guy. Uh, this is his Naruto channel. He does have another channel. I cannot remember what it's called, but he talks about it in the end of his video. Um, and you're gonna want to watch the God of Akatsuki Explain, where he talks about Hidden. But anywho, he goes on and he talks about um, the video talking about uh, Hidan and his belief in Joshism. Um, and there's a part of it that he said that really got me thinking. Um, I can't remember the exact word for it, um, but let me try and find the, the snippet. Hold that thought. ...to show Kakuzo and Hidan where his village was. And it's eventually revealed that this village was hidden with Genjutsu, which is why Hidan and Kakuzo were never able to find continue talking about Joshinus, and Hohozuki has already decided that he wants to join in the religion. However, Hohozuki has some qualms, some fears, that he may not be as strong as the people on Earth who advocate for peace, and thus will be killed before he can give his full worship to the Lord Joshi. However, Hidan, in a very interesting moment of character development for Hidan, tells Hohozuki that people who advocate for peace don't exist, saying that when Hidan was leaving the village and he was trying to kill his neighbors, for being peaceful, the shinobi of the village tried to kill him first, stating that if these shinobi truly loved peace, they would have let themselves die. Which is backwards logic, but if you get into the meat of it, it kind of makes a little bit of sense. In essence, what Hidan is saying, that anybody who truly believes in peace above all should never come into conflict, even if it means their own life. In essence, Hidan is saying a twisted version of Naruto trying to break the cycle of hatred. By responding to violence with other greater violence, you are, in essence, spitting in the face of peace. If you look at it from a sense of morality, a rather interesting argument. In a more nihilistic vein, the greater schemes of what happens on Earth have no true sense of morality. But yeah, I hope that clears that up. Again, if you want to watch the, the whole video, it's, it is right there, and, uh, NC Hammer 23 as well as check out his TikTok because he does have a TikTok. I don't think he uploads as much on TikTok because he's on, you know, this app. Uh, he's on the other app as well. Um, but yeah, definitely check it out. Um, I really hope that actually helped. But yeah, uh, let me know what you think of that hot take.